Hey, what's up again? So, I wanted to bring up this question about physical fitness and pushing your body to the limits. You know, top human performance. Well, which is tougher? Running a marathon, which is 26.2 miles, or doing a thousand push-ups? Now, I have done one of those, and that's run a marathon. And from my personal experience, running a marathon, it's pretty brutal, you know. It doesn't matter how fast or how slow you're going. Your, your legs, you know, your feet, your ankles, your knees, your calves, your hamstrings, your quads, all your joints in your lower body, at least from your hip and down, take a massive beating when you're going that distance. Now, I'm not saying that if you go further, you know, it's going to be worse, though. But, because, you know, don't forget about ultra runners that run 50, 100 miles at a time. You know, that's, again, that's great. And they wear usually minimal shoes with, like, very less cushion. Almost no shoes, you know, like barefoot running. But... What I notice, it, uh, yeah, it really tires me out completely. Um, I was sore for about three, four days after the run. I did it in two hours and 41 minutes. Um, give or take, I'm not quite sure. See, my math is really bad, though. Haha, <laughs> I'm an American, but yeah. Anyways, uh, 5.50 something. I think it was a little bit under 6. I'm not sure. Could have been over six, but give or take, it's somewhere around there. That was like my average mile split for the whole entire race. Now, yeah, again, does it test, you know, the body, the human, human fitness, you know, your capabilities of doing something? Does, does running that much test those limits? Or getting down and just doing a thousand push-ups. Now, as many as some of you have seen here on my YouTube channel that I have been doing push-ups. Now, give or take, uh, I've been, I missed quite a few days for for most of that uh, journey, which I'm still doing though. Now, even though I haven't been uh, putting them online, I've still been doing push-ups lately. I'm getting close to 30,000 push-ups for, for uh, almost uh, 11 months because on February 24th of this year, it's going to end because when I started, I figured, all right, how many push-ups could I do in one year? And I found out the world record was set by Patty Doyle, I think in the late 80s or early 90s or so, and he did about 1.5 million push-ups. I mean, give or take, that's going to be about like... Something like 4,000 push-ups a day. It, trust me, it's, it's fucking ridiculous. Like, it's, I mean, I give full respect for Patty Doyle for doing that. Or anybody who gets close, though. But, I mean, the closest I got was about 663 push-ups. You know, I tried to do 1,000, but I was short. Now, doing 663 push-ups versus running a marathon... Honestly, what I found more challenging was doing the push-ups. Now, you're thinking, all right, all you do is get down, you just start pushing away, you know, like, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, and then, of course, you have to go out and run like a marathon, you know. You know, you're breathing, you're moving your arms, like the whole body. But, honestly, I was more tired doing the push-ups than running. You know, yeah, I was only down on the ground just <coughs> cranking them out. But the thing is, though, afterwards, not only were my arms just completely gone, but I felt it around my shoulders, traps, chest, abs, back, even my legs, like around my hips, were tired. I mean, toward the end, I was shaking, almost to the point where I couldn't do the push-ups. And I'm just like... Holy crap, push-ups are just not upper body, they're whole body. And I can honestly tell you that 
after I did 663 push-ups, I was sore, tired, literally, for about almost a week. And that that is pretty sad, though. It, it really is. But I just never felt that way from doing a single exercise. And to be honest with you, I just... Uh, it, the the soreness that I got it, but then the strength that I got later. The running didn't even come close to it, though. You know, I felt like I was pushing myself more, just trying to get my body up with doing one single motion, than just you know doing the running motion, trying to, trying to run over twenty six miles. It was just crazy. I'm like, how could a single push up? You know, something that you learned in PE when you're in elementary school or middle school be so so challenging, you know? That's why they say push-ups, you know, it's the king of exercise, and I believe it. Just seriously. I, I would challenge any muscle head or, you know, gym rat. I mean, I'm talking about a big-ass motherfucker who he believes that the bench press is the king of all exercise, or, you know, deadlift, squat, whatever, that he just lifts weights and he thinks calisthenics is a complete waste of time. I challenge them to at least get down and do a thousand push-ups. And, yeah, they're going to say, that's not going to benefit me. It's a complete waste of time. I'm not going to get results. It's not going to be as effective as lifting weights. Oh, really? Have you tried? Some will say, yeah. Okay, fucking show me then. Or some say, no, I haven't tried, it's just a waste of time. I'll be like, alright, then you're a fucking pussy then. Seriously. Get down on the floor, try to do a thousand push-ups in like a 30 minute time frame, or 45. I guarantee you, most people will fail. Most so-called strong fit guys that are in the gym, that live in the gym 24-7, I bet you they're not going to finish it. I bet you they're not going to finish it. You know? It's like the the fittest people, the strongest people that I've seen or known could do a feat like this. But yet, I see big fat ass average Joe out there running a marathon. You know, and like any other people, like from, well not kids, but really young people to elderly, all kinds of people, you know, like almost anybody from age 18 and up. They could they could do a marathon. Yeah, it's gonna be excruciating pain, you know, you're gonna suffer all that crap, you know, after you're done though. They're gonna say, Man, that was the test of physical fitness. But really, how many people could do a thousand push ups compared to running a marathon? Yeah, you see? Numbers don't lie. they 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 tell you the truth. So in my opinion, I think doing a thousand push ups is a lot harder than running a marathon. Because I've ran a marathon before, but I still can't do a thousand push-ups. Again, it's just I'm speaking for the truth. That's all I gotta say. Bye.